What's going on everybody? In this quick video tutorial, I'm going to share some quick fixes which hopefully will help overcome low level exceptions which can sometimes occur in Premiere Pro, which often results in crashes to the software. So let's go. So the first fix I use is quick and easy and it's the clear media cache. Clear the media cache, you go to edit, preferences, memory cache and delete unused. This is a quick and easy solution and hopefully it fixes it in the first instance. But most often than not, you'll need to go to the next two fixes for the low level exception issue. So the second fix is clearing the preferences in Premiere Pro. So before you do this, just make sure you save your keyboard shortcuts first or else you have to remap your keyboard once again. So to reset the preferences, cl close down Premiere Pro, hold down the Alt key on PC before clicking onto the keyboard shortcut. So from here, Premiere Pro will prompt you to reset the preferences and if you do, hopefully that fixes the low level exception. Now if that still doesn't fix it, here's my final solution which hopefully it will. So the final fix involves going to your Adobe working folder directory. So it goes straight into Adobe video previews. From here, what I find works for me is deleting all the video previews. And what I find most of the time by deleting these video previews, it will overcome the low level exception issue. But I leave this as the last option because it is time consuming rendering your project once again. But I always try the first two fixes first, the clear mini cache and resetting the preferences in Premiere Pro because they're the quickest and easiest ones to do. And yeah, hopefully those fixes resolve the low level exception issue in Premiere Pro. As always, thank you for watching the video. Please hit the like and subscribe buttons to help support my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Cheers. Come on, go back.